weather, a major hurricane that still bears watching in the Atlantic and some storms moving through the area late this afternoon. First alert, Chief Meteorologist Steve Weagle here tonight with what you need to know if you're heading out. Steve? Yeah, John, uh, thankfully the uh, stormy weather is starting to taper off and we're looking at a pretty good Saturday evening. In the tropics, I know there was a lot of anxiety about where Lee was headed. There's Lee tonight, still a Category 3 hurricane and expected to continue that west-northwest track. Uh, a lot of folks in South Florida were worried that it may have an impact here. That still looks very unlikely as a turn is expected on Wednesday toward the north. And it may have an impact around New England or Atlantic Canada uh, the, late next week, about, uh, well, about seven or eight days from now. Here's the forecast track. This 5 p.m. advisory winds at 115, moving west-northwest at 10. You'll notice a turn in that track. At Wednesday and Thursday, almost due north at that point, not the same latitude as us or a little higher north, which is nice to see too. The computer model tracks in very good agreement here, making that turn Wednesday uh, in the late morning, early afternoon. And then the tracks, there's some discrepancy on just how fast it uh, goes after that. But at that point, it really doesn't matter because it's heading away from our area. It's driven by a high pressure system, the Bermuda High, and a strong trough coming up the east coast. And this is the reason why this really didn't have any uh, chance of making it into our area. It acts like a wall and storms just aren't going to go through that strong trough as it sits there. Warm water ahead. It is forecast to become a category four again. For us, we will feel indirect impacts with this massive swell that is developing in this hurricane. And it starts to develop more Tuesday through Wednesday and Thursday, likely peaking later in the week. Significant beach erosion is possible from this. We'll talk more about this and the uh, local weather through the rest of the weekend.